Hi friends, this session I am going to explain about exchange rates in SAP. Exchange rates are used to define a relationship between two currencies and also to maintain a exchange rates that are used to translate an amount to other currency. So mainly we use exchange rates for three purposes. One is posting and clearing, exchange rate differences and foreign currency valuation. What is posting and clearing? So posting and clearing we use to translate amounts posted or cleared in foreign currency or to check a manually exchange rates that are during posting or clearing. Second one is exchange rate differences. So with that we can come to know whether it is determined whether it is a gain or loss from exchange rate differences. And third one foreign currency valuation. So to evaluate open items in foreign currency and foreign currency balance sheet accounts as part of the closing operations. Now we see how we can configure exchange rates in SAP. Go to SPR book. Go to IMG reference. SAP NetViewer. General settings. Currencies. Enter exchange rates, and if we execute, we come to the currency exchange rates here. So, here we can see three kind of exchange rates. One is buying rate, second one is selling rate, third one is average rate. So if you go to the exchange rates, so we can define here. So B stands for standard translation that is selling rate. G stands for standard translation at bank buying rate. M means standard translation at average rate. So we can maintain in document type, so what currency you are going to select for exchange rates. Now I am going to maintain exchange rate ratios for my currencies. You can go different translation ratios for currencies. Click on S. So, if I want to maintain my exchange rate, so I can give here my exchange rate from USD to INR and I valid from. 0101-2017 and I am maintaining ratios for two, these two currencies is 1 is to 1. Just hit enter, save it. So between these two currencies I am maintaining ratio of 1 is to 1. Just click new button. configuration for my Sun company code. Just save it as a transport request. Now I am going to select exchange rates. So I am going to maintain exchange rates for these two currencies. Just click on new button and exchange rate type I am going to select as B valid from 1 1 2017 and uh, exchange rate USD to my currency I am going to select as 65 and uh, 2 I am selecting as 
iron now. Same way, I am going to select G as my buying rate. I am selling, I am buying for USD and I am buying for 62 currencies and so average rate also 1 1 2017 from USD and average rate is 63 and my two currencies and save it Translations we maintained only for SD two INR valid from one is to one and average SD two INR ratio is one is to one. Save it. So it's already saved. So with this, so we have maintained simple configuration steps for exchange rates. Thank you. Thanks for watching.